Hi there guys, welcome to my channel Draw With Ease. My name is Nuan and today I'll be teaching you guys how to draw a sea turtle. So let's get started today. Alright, so we're going to start with drawing a curved line over the top like that, as you can see there. Okay, we're going to bring it back and we're going to sort of uh, do another little line there. It's kind of like we're drawing a heart shape on its side. Now we're going to draw in the um, big smiley mouth for the so sea turtle there and uh, we're going to sort of block out his face there. So finish off the head and uh, add in all the other features. So I'm drawing in the eyes there, nice big cartoony eyes. Um, the uh, sea turtle looks kind of similar to the ones you'll see in Finding Nemo. So I'm just blocking it in, um, the iris there, just to give our sea turtle a bit of a very alive sort of feel there. And uh, doing the same for the other eyes. So what I'm doing here is I'm just sort of adding in those features. So there's the nostrils as well. And um, you'll also see that I'm, my hand's in the way there, but I'm trying to draw like the, the sea turtle's mouth there, so it's like a little beak shape um, that we'll fill out later. Now we're going to move along, we're going to draw the shell. So the shell's a nice big arch shape like that, it looks like we're drawing bird's wings, but not really. Um, now we're going to draw another abrupt straight line back there, and we're going to join it all up and finish off the shell, attach it to the neck, and there's, there's the basic outline of the sea turtle's shell. I'm um, going to draw in an L shape there, that's the uh, sea turtle's chin, or like the jawline basically. Um, and now we're going to draw in the front flippers. Again the front flippers also have a very aerodynamic look, like you're drawing bird's wings or plane's wings, so that's what I'm doing here. Um, sort of go out like that, then go back in. And we'll draw the other one as well, uh, just for a bit of perspective, make sure you keep them in, in, in shape. They're, they're basically the same shape, but the, the back one they're just a little bit smaller for perspective. Um, as we move along here, now I'm going to draw in the belly of our sea turtle. Make sure it joins up to the front flipper there, so that way it's all in check. And now we're going to draw the back flippers. So these are a little bit more, um, a little bit more sturdier, a bit, st a bit stumpier, um, as obviously they're used for steering uh, when that sea turtle is swimming. So we've got the basic outline there. Now what I'm doing is um, filling it all in, right? So I'm going to add a bit of detail later on. So what I'm doing is I'm segmenting the, the, the flippers and the, the, the back the back fins there um, because sea turtles have very sort of, uh, how do I put it, um, they've got very scaly sort of textured sort of look there. So that's what I'm trying to do here. Um, so there's little lines there just to sort of segment his, his skin um, because they do have very, yeah, they have very scaly skin basically. Um, so these little finer details are what make the drawing really come to life. So don't ever forget those. Adding a few more lines there around around the, the joints because you know they do swim a lot and it does leave creases in the uh, skin and they're filling out the, uh, the the belly as well. So what I'm doing is just really adding in those finer details because we've got the basic shape now. It's time to have a bit of fun with the drawing. Okay, so we're also going to do the same thing um, to the shell. Okay, and remember it's uh, that segmented texture. We want to keep that. So um, make sure you yeah you you follow the shape of the shell. And then, yeah, you join all the lines up. So there we go. I'm just trying to get that right perspective um, for the sea turtle shell. So there we go. So make sure you follow the line of it, and that way you'll keep that perspective in, 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 in check there, basically. So there we go. All right, so I'm just adding more lines just to really um, enhance the structure of our sea turtle. And yeah, that way he looks like a very happy, outgoing kind of character. So what I'm doing here is just, yeah, getting this, this segment, that segmentation right. So adding the lines up there and then also at the bottom um, because the shell kind of has like a very helmet-like structure to it. So that's what I'm trying to, trying to do here. Um, more lines just to even it up. There we go. So you can see the turtle is, our sea turtle is now coming to life. You can, you can see how the, those, little, those little lines and little details what really brings the, the, the drawing out of the page. So just to give it more like an alive uh, sort of feeling, I'm adding a few circles. Um, they'll obviously represent bubbles because our sea turtle is going for a nice swim underwater today. Um, a few more circles there for more bubbles. So you can see he's a, yeah, it, it looks like it's really sort of lifting out of the page now. Um, a few more lines, so just really sort of getting that all done. And now, obviously the finishing touches, getting our sharpie and we're going to outline it. And unfortunately it looks like my nose has decided to make an appearance on the screen there. So I really apologize for that. But um, we're basically adding the finishing touches, so outlining everything, adding those finer details, and you'll see how um, in the final drawing when you see it, you'll see how those little lines, those little details, is what really brings that drawing, you know, out of the page and and, and gives it that really sort of um, yeah, that ver a very 
uh, you know, excitable feel. So there's the there's the bake there. I think there's little details, and we'll probably speed it up at this point and uh, get it done, dust it out of the way. So there we have it, guys. We hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel, and stay tuned for more upcoming videos. Thanks again. Thank you.